Jazakallah. Now I request to Professor Anisudin Bhattisa, please come on the, his lecture on the DDH and walking age group. Thank you, Parvez. And uh, indeed, it is a great honor for me and uh, to be with you. And uh, uh, thank you to my international guests, Javed Iqbal, Saeed, and all others who are coming. Uh, nearly by 12, everyone will be here, inshallah, for honoring the Pediatric Orthopedic Society, basically, to be here having in the hip surgery review course, uh, first time in Karachi, otherwise we had in the Lahore as well. Otherwise, we usually do every two, three months uh, live surgery courses, and this is a unique, uh, we will have an international guest and they will operate. Professor Jerry Chomiak has arrived at the morning at 6 a.m. His second lecture will be by him and three more lectures. And he will join by toil. I ask him to be, have a good series so that we can discuss with him. And uh, Sekandar has the first lecture and inshallah, he will also arrive. His son is a little bit ill, that's why he uh, delayed. So I'm presenting as a second lecture. Thank you very much. And this is basically a uh, walking age guru. I added toddler and teenage because of the visa problem of the uh, Jerry. Now he got it and he's here. So the second part of this teenage and the older age will be taken by him. So next, please. Yeah, mujhe de de. So, here my slide. Always I show this. This is the only disease which is obscure at birth. You can't recognize unless you do a certain test. Otherwise, everything is recognized up to 60s. This was even unrecognizable at time of birth and late in the Europe as well. And after 63, they have worked on the Artolani and these tests. They come to recognize there are tests and there is. There. Otherwise, there were multiple late coming cases in the Europe and the Western public, though we have yet at the age of 12 and 10. Last week, I operated 10 year, 12 year, and 13 uh, and 8 year age, uh, four cases. So, this was basically denied by you see here. You can see the orthogrammatic space, but you cannot see the deviation. You can see the congenital dislocation D and everything. So this time you will become obscure and it comes late to us. And many of time in this slide again I show, if it is treated untreated, it will be not so significant problem if it is managed better. And this is an example of better management. She is walking with this age at the seven, six years, but she was operated elsewhere, other country, and this was the solution, and she was not able to even sit and walk. So if you don't know, don't operate. You operate if you want to operate, operate with the principal, so that have you have good results. And other cases also, same era you find. So if it is mishandled, it produces a significant problems of AV and re-dislocation, lifelong problems. Though this girl was operated again by me and now is doing better, but there was a problem. So if you maintain the principles of arches of Lebanon is there for 4,000 year old arches, they are there. Even despite of the earthquakes, they are there because the principle was followed. If you follow the principles, you will have a good result. So principle in DDS surgery, are not significantly different in any age. Principle is same. That is anatomical concentric reduction without any pressure on the femoral head with the minimum chances of late osteoarthritis at the late age. This should be the principle. But protocol do vary with the age groups because in younger age we do the medial approach when there is over the one year we do anterior approach when there is CP we do the classic approach when it is 12 we do the uh, rotational start. We, we can't do the salter in the 12 years age. So protocol varies, but the principles remain same. So objective is the optimal condition for mutual growth stimulating effect. These are the wordings of the salter in 1963. Can you provide an atmosphere of the hip by reducing the hips have a mutual growth stimulating effect of femoral head on the acetabulum. So when you operate the DDA, you always find the vertical diameter deformed head. But when it is in, in few years, the good acetabulum, that is a mutual growth stimulant effect and prevent resubluxations in AVN. It means it should not be with pressure, without pressure reduction should be there and achieve painless mobile hip at the adolescent age. So that is our target, our objective. So rational approach is careful evaluation and tailored with the age Tailor with the severity of dysplasia and the position of stability, which is the fifth principle I will talk. Okay, 
because if you don't consider severity of dysplasia tone is 4 and 3 and you reduce with the force it force the dysplasia the radian so severity dysplasia must be considered if you take this rational approach you will have a good results and this is a very good slide multiple people have given this slide there is a results of the age per age group under the two years age when you reduce it results are 95 percent at adulthood if age increases 80 percent when you operate at the age of the eight years when the pubic symphysis pubic symphysis is become as stiff then your results are 50 percent right so it is tailored as per the age group the at the age at the time of surgery then second is the acetabular development this slide shows when they are reduced in early age group they have good acetabular index development and early treatment best acetabular development there are multiple literatures available and minimum rate of avian you will find so this is the severity of dysplasia we usually find uh, do with the tonus grading but in the age group when you have no physis ihdi grading international hip score uh, that will do the uh, diagnosis but grading usually depend on the severity of dysplasia which is shown here how uh, most of the time you are um, uh, examining do a wrong line they calculate from here no it is from here tonus grading is from the age of the acetabulum okay so this will tell you grade two three four depending on severity and other is the acetabulum double acetabulum single acetabulum once i was discussed with professor Inam, he said i do double pemberton osteotomy because there are two acetabulums so i still but i could not do this sir <laughs> i will learn from you inshallah okay so this is again the single acetabulum, very obtuse acetabulum, double acetabulum. You have to correct these deformities. Last week we, I was operating with the triple rotation and I did the triple rotation because the acetabulum was a little bit wide. Same there, there was a good space there. So I said this may sublex it. Then I always bring a capsule in between the acetabulum and there is a space, uh, the superior capsule to the inferior. So that, that space should fill and that metaplasty occur and this should not sublex it. Alhamdulillah, this, uh, 11, 11 years child. Last week we have done it is a good. So severity of dysplasia is very important. Then severity of dysplasia depends also on the stiffness of the hip. Of the arthrogripotic child. You are going to the percutaneous stenotomy and reducing. Okay. And you have to dissect these cases. Spastic cerebral palsy today. First case you will see in which the professor will do inferior approach with the Kissick approach and reduce it. The severity dependent tightness. If the patient comes here to you at 11 year, 11 month and you say, okay, wait it for six months more, six months, there is significant tightness. You have to reduce it and reduce without pressure. That can be with the shortening of the femur. Don't avoid shortening even in the 13 months and the 18 months I have done because of tightness of hip. And this tightness half you can see at the test of stability when you are reducing. So arthrograpid, this then there is an adequate soft tissue release. That is a big problem. Many of time I have more than series of more than 60 cases, and I found intact acetabular ligament transfer, intact for uh, 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 teres ligament. So you have to do a meticulous dissection in very high riding here. You uh, last week we had a uh, ligament and teres of two centimeter length and my thin size big ligament of teres. And if you leave it there. It will not allow you a good reduction. An initial good reduction is very important. So, good soft tissue release must be. I have found many times rectus femoris intact. Many times I find the iliosus intact. They have not touched it. And sometimes a uh, big child. There is a separate lecture. Professor Iqbal will discuss on this lecture. And when most important, other important thing is, oh, bhai, kaise jayega? This one. You have to dissect this portion from the ileum and then bring down the capsule. This is the particular dissection. There's superior articular structures which are because of thick displaced because of the dysplastic hip. And you find a half centimeter thick acetabular uh, capsule you find always. And that is adherent with the uh, superior margin. So you have at least dissected this from the abductors, bring it this, uh, uh, down the capsule so that you have a good meticulous reduction are the capsule therapy you have. If you don't do, there may be a problem. May not be, but may be a problem. Send structural abnormalities. On older age group, over one and a half year, you will find coxa velga. And coxa velga always with the coxa vera. And you find a big, this is the co uh, coxa 
Velga antiversion, and you find overhanged hypertrophic and the overhanged uh, greater trochanter. So these are the structural changes. If you find the structural changes over a of three years, you must correct it. If you don't correct, then there may be a problem. But till uh, around 10 years back, I used to do in every case the virus. Now I don't do because literature says it really comes from. But at the age of 12, 18, uh, 13 years, 12 years, 8 years, so he has gone his remodeling capacity. So you have to do some little virus. And in the paralytic cases, you need a virus rotation. So a structural abnormality must be corrected. This is Sir Sakhar Bridge. And this was a train which was run over when the first bridge was suspended. Bridge was built. That was the test of stability by British era. Or a Kedi ne kiya tha. A prisoner was called and he ran this whole of the train. The train gone and everyone is clapping. There's a test of stability of the bridge. So you have to apply a test of stability part. That is called catural test of stability. Reduce it. See what is the good position. And do rotational osteotomy. You may do a Dega. You may button you may do salter this depends on the test of stability 2002 article jbjs january so there is general test of stability this is the showing the test of stability my case when you do adduction flexion it's come out and it is stable in the abduction and flexion it means he has a superior deficit and you will find my module of the test of stability in the youtube name my name and uh, that is available. This is pre, this is post salter, and this shows the stability at image intensifier. So I always do in older cases after osteosynthesis. In case which you can reduce easily before osteosynthesis, you can do. And always by opening the capsule. And sometimes people say even after closing the capsule, you can do the arthrogram. You can do the MRI. In USA, I've seen MRI being done in the desk room to see the vascularity and to see. The reduction, that is called test of stability. And you will find this test of module on YouTube of Anis Bhatti. You can learn and you can detail to go through. I will not go in detail. Then treatment protocol over at walking age groups. Same principle. Protocol varies according to the deformities and tightness. So then we do the capsulorating. Everything which is related I have discussed. And see the superior deficit and do the pelvic osteotomy. So here is the intra-articular structures and the capsular artery. And the procedure is basically a super leg. Technique we use Smith-Peterson. People use the bikini, but I'm not used to the bikini extension. I use Smith-Peterson approach. Technique is super leg. Every structure has to be done. Before 2006, I used to do Kissick method. Today, we will do the same with the inferior approach after osteotomy, and probably will do that. Okay? So, this is the technique, and this is the case of bilateral reduction, and eight years follow. After a good, stable hip capsular refi, uh, it was operated. Uh, she had a public harness failed on the right side, so operated on the right side, and left side was with the public harness. Okay? And reduced after eight years. Another case, Mars, 26 months I operated with the OR capsule. At that time, I used to do distal derotation osteotomy, okay, for the rotation purpose. And this was the six years follow up, and this was the six year follow up, but he scored good because he takes support, like sitting this. Otherwise, he don't take support, so, but he is score two, and uh, 18 years last. I think this year, I think it was. I can't, I call every patient after 10 years. I have the follow up, I have the numbers, and I call every patient. Now, recently, I had about 15 patients in this month, I 10 year follow ups. And they were surprised. We, you remember me? Yes, I can show you, give you this photo, your photo of that age. They were surprised. I have them. Alhamdulillah. This 18 years follow up. Again, support you get because of this department. He had an AVN. I still remember, I have the detail. Uh, AVN. After the AVN, he developed good head. But he don't know what is happening with him. He's very comfortable, he's doing his business. But we know what is the problem. So I asked him, okay, there is something, but go ahead, no problem. So this was the good initial reduction. Another case, the girl came, 
कि मैं आई मेरी मैं आई हैव एन प्रॉब्लम आफ्टर टू इयर्स दिस वाज द बायोलेटरल डीडीएच एंड सिक्स वीक्स दिस इज थ्री मंथ्स फॉलो अप एंड सी द ट्वेल्थ इयर्स फॉलो अप अगस्त ट्वेंटी थ्री वेरी गुड फिमोरल हेड बिकॉज़ यू फॉलो द राइट एंड अगेन टू बिकॉज़ लिटिल बिट सपोर्ट शीट इज ऑन दिस साइड दैट्स व्हाई आई रेड टू स्क्वाड डबल पी टू स्क्वाड टू otherwise i have i don't miss the put the keep the photos so good excellent recovery and she is done this is the my record keeping of the uh, pediatric arthropathic registry the said patient i entered i took this picture from the registry but i forget where is the in which laptop it is so i have a registry you have the registry you people are entering the your cases whole details is there and you can see your cases you can evaluate your cases what is the benefit from that i get to know was at area otherwise i can't remember it was 13 year back 18 year back so another is our 3 years age group always you need a shot because two high dislocations if you don't do it will not so protocol change here in previous cases you did not have a shot here you have the tumor charting and various dislocation in this particular case i have done because on lateral side i took 1 cm on medial side to 2 cm And there was a good reduction in pervertebral osteotomy. Where I have done no preoperative. I never used the preoperative. I have seen many cases of preoperative early in 90s when they were coming and the uh, complications. No preoperative allows. This is the literature, and this study shows very good studies. And Schuhnicker, the son is now a present day. Schuhnicker is giving this study, and they shows open reduction after traction and open reduction. without traction tumor tumor they said the avian direct tumor traction is 8% redistribution subjective direct tumor traction is 12% here it is 30% so traction is obsolete you should not give used to be in 18 we used to be give the zero section in the field and when i was a student so then surgical approach also i changed my surgical approach in 2006 before that i was doing kesic because my boss trained me in the kesic and then uh, i switch over to the two incision approach and that is called the way this one the today you will do i think sir ye this one from here you go from here after osteotomy capsulotomy bring the femoral head here and next if you do this after this is called kesic approach and this is the principle from the yugoslavia he introduced his teacher before that introduced obradani and then this is the kesic culture there was a 7% avian and i had the avian in these cases so i changed to double incision approach and this is the double incision approach which was the wegner 1984 so separate incision and separate incision for shorting i usually uh, fix this uh, tumor tumor head as it will be tending in the diversion then pull it and see how much osteotomy you need otherwise you can assess the pre operative and i find Uh, 5 mm to 10 mm difference by pulling and by radiology so when the radiology you may need a 3 cm uh, uh, shorting but here really maximum i have done 2.5 cm but javed do 3 4 no problem because it's big <laughs> thank you sir okay so double incision approach same technique of sumar will but open rotation but good soft tissue release you can have and this is my ancestor lesh and uh, then pelvic osteotomies you need multiple pelvic osteotomies are there some temporal osteotomies are for big rotational osteotomy certain are the redirectional osteotomy and two main groups and then there is salvage the three osteotomies are there objective to improve the more of the coverage med coverage should be more than not less than uh, 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 can i make 15% not more than 15 percent covered so you must have a good coverage folks are where are joint stability and good quality of initial reduction good quality of initial reduction is very important if you find reduction is not good check it why it is not good for up to with the test of speed if your k wire is in the acetabulum it is out this will produce a problem later right so must see initial good if you have a good initial reduction easy initial reduction there is no fail okay so i will also speak on this these are the rotational aspects that is called the sorter triple triple mendel there are varieties then pericapsular atrophy pemberton and dega 
their salvage has done in PRE and the stylus shell. Okay. So here is the as per age group and as per the trial radiate cartilage G1. So variation in the protocol varies because of the age, because of the stiffness of the tri radiate cartilage, because of the stiffness of the symphysis pubis. And these are different cuts. You can see in detail. कल जो आपने स्लाइड देखा थी बारह आते हैं ये मेरे बोलो उसे देखना भी ऑल दिस लेक्चर आर प्रेजेंट इन द यूट्यूब बट दे आर वन वन अवर लेक्चर्स सिक्स लेक्चर्स ऑन डीडीएच बट यू कैन फाइंड ओके सो दिस इज़ द ट्रिपल साल्टर सास्टार्टमी वेरी पॉपुलर आस्टार्टमी यू नो सेम एंड देन द ट्रिपल your age. So, Salter Astyatmi animation through the fossa, uh, rim of the sciatic notch, directly over superior and inferior muscle beach may transverse. To cut it with the, he is cutting with the astrotome, but we do jiggly saw and then introduce a graft from from here and introduce the graft here and put the K wires because it is total transection of the rim of the acetabulo which is unstable therefore you must place the k wires and be careful your k wire should not be in the acetabulum this is one of the case by the i use the femoral resected segment six year age at the time of operation five weeks and uh, this was the case actually animation ta, elsewhere i was asking was this salt a good option for this case so I think the, the animation nickel gaye. Yes, there is there. There is a you always think four years, five years age. Salter is good but good. But if you see there is a problem here. They have salted the salter, but they could not achieve the suitable of coverage because the salter gave you 15 degrees over the 20 degree, but not the 45 degree of the CW cannot be covered. Therefore, this salter has to me was not a good option for them because you see. And you can just follow the circumcision. So it was not a good option. Better option was Pemberton. Okay? Pemberton astrology, just go to through the animation. And here is the Pemberton astrology, very capsular astrology. We don't cut the rim inside. We go to the dry radiate cartilage and we bring down the wide acetabulum to short acetabulum, small acetabulum. This is the animation and graft. This is one of the girls, Aisha Wakil, operated with the Pemberton astrology. Huge. Courage and good after this is another case. Tonis Pemberton, right hip submanjated. Previously, it was operated by somewhere else, then either the structure, Pemberton. Case examples, charting, four years age girl. This case was my third case, which operated with the Professor Babu. Before that, two cases I have learned from the Professor Salim. And these three, these are the two, three cases I have seen with glasses. They are applied for solo flight. So this was published in 2017, uh, 1997, 2009 article, three years later. Now she is, she is 34 years now, but she has a photo of the hair. But at 10 years, she has a good considerable coverage. This is another case operated three years, before a chart in Salter. Good initial reduction you can find here. And see, after 14 years, 17 years age, she was asking for I'm sorry for the So this is the 14 years follow driver surplus. Another case, this is a very important case. I evaluated the case. This was the girl which was operated in 7 years. And when she was in Cherry last year, at that time I used KYS to stability. 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 And you will find here something important. So, who won the Dusra lecture? Man? Important here, it always is said the chalice produces the bump inside and reduce the pelvic space. Maybe a problem in the pregnancy. But see, after 10 years, even at 15 months, that is gone. And if you see this girl after 16 years, excellent acetabulum, no problem, absolutely not. And late. So, cherries don't produce a problem. But I don't do cherries nowadays, I do Pemberton. At that time, I was not knowing the Pemberton. So, switch to her. Good, because she takes a little bit of support. Otherwise, 
T is SLF. Good, but T score LLD one centimeter. Another case left to this Afghanistan, operated at the age of five years, two years follow up, and this is five years follow up. You find best rate. All is because you have a good initial reduction. If you do good initial reduction without pressure, without any, you will not find any complications, and you have excellent results. But I will show you my complications as well in the conference. Okay, why? Why I changes the methods? Another case operated Fox Mashakil, three years age, two year follow up, left side. Okay, this was the basically pelvic pain. That's why you find here. She has little uh, less flexion in pinch band, eight year above. This lecture will be given by the Komiak. Therefore, I stop here. Principle is same. Protocol changes. So I go forward. Leave this all for the Professor Jerry Chomiok, and uh, I go directly to the conclusion because this case did you see these are the my DDH uh, available on the YouTube. After I get the phone call, I Yes, yes, yes. You can find my eight lectures on DDH in the YouTube. And this is a summary slide from Professor Javed Iqbal. I still remember, sir. This is your slide. And it shows public heart rate below six years, below 18 months close with the adducted artery, and sometime open reduction. It is written there. And after 18 months to three years, don't avoid if you need a shortening and derotation. You do it. Otherwise, there will be a problem. After three years, usually it is high, and you need a more shortening. Derotation, there is. And it will be cast yard. And uh, about six years, sir, to kati karte kya na yaar bhool jaa sam. Chhendiya ko? Dega. Nee, dega ka ho. Chhendiya ko wali. Usse nee na. Ganzel chhendiya ko wali. He he do kya na? Ati. Thank you, Ati. Thank you, man. You do most of the time. Ganz. I I have no experience of it. Because I don't have astrotomes. Abhi bhi operation theater mein na. Maine astrotomes sabke kharaab kar diye. Wo trade karke mujhse karta ho. तो ट्रिपल कर रहा था वापस से आया सर आपने हमारा आस्ट्रेट को खराब कर दिया मैंने कहा ठीक करो यार ठीक करो उसे कर्व कर दिया नहीं मंगाए हैं जब तक आ जाएं दैट्स व्हाई आई सेड यू आर डूइंग आई डोंट हैव ओके गुड भाई ये सब प्रिंसिपल फॉलो करना इस गधे का प्रिंसिपल फॉलो नहीं करना यार वरना ये हो जाएगा क्या कह रहा था ये क्या प्रिंसिपल है किसी को नहीं है कौन है ये तो मैं जानता हूँ ये तो जानते हो है इसका प्रिंसिपल अपना है जो कुछ जब पहले मारो जाके वृद्ध देखेंगे अमेरिकन प्रिंसिपल इसलिए कहा उसको खत्म करो प्रिंसिपल को प्रीएम्प्टिव करो रेगन का है नहीं बोलो इसी का मिला था मतलब नहीं है अमेरिकन सो इन्होंने कहा कि सुक्रेट है कि प्रिंसिपल फॉलो करोगे तो आधा काम तो हो ही गया सारा लेक्चर मेरा काम है तकरीब में रिसी पे थी हमारे साइडर कहते हैं कि ये आर्थोपेडिक में भी अगर आप ये प्रिंसिपल अंडरस्टूड करें फॉलो करें एरर को कोई चांस ही नहीं फॉलो द प्रिंसिपल राइट एंड और इसने फॉलो किया फॉलो कर दिया टोटल जो है 20 किलोग्राम है इसको कुशोरिंग के लिए आप प्रिंसिपल फॉलो किया और हम ये भी प्रिंसिपल फॉलो करते हैं आजकल इसके साथ चलते हैं ये ना प्रिंसिपल कोई भी चोर नहीं है सारी तारे ही तारे ना सो यू कैन हेल्प दी माय लेटर्स ऑन द यूट्यूब थैंक यू वेरी मच एनी क्वेश्चन आर हेयर सिंपली स्टार्टेड एंड वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस वाइल्ड लेटर के लिए जाओ शुरू हो गया कोई क्वेश्चन जस्ट आई विल स्टार्ट विथ द प्रोक्सिमो